Well, Earth Day is like our birthday uh, because organic is all about the Earth. Millions will celebrate Earth Day this year. Organic Styles' Gerald Prohlman among them. Well, Earth Day is important to everybody who lives on the Earth because this is the planet we live on. We have to take care of it. If we don't, it won't be here. And it's a chance to remember the things that we need to do to take care of the beautiful planet we live on. So where did Earth Day begin? Some claim it was here, in Santa Barbara, California. Yeah, we believe we're actually the, the, the home of the first Earth Day. 40 years ago, an accident in one of those oil derricks offshore covered this beach in oil, killing animals, taking months to clean up, and giving birth to the modern environmental movement. It had a lasting effect. Um, People remember that where they don't remember anything else about Santa Barbara. In environmental terms, it was pretty much the sound heard around the world. It took crews 11 days to stop the rupture that left 35 miles of coastline covered in oil. Thousands of gallons. And the problem was that it was just spilling out. Nobody, nobody knew what to do with it. It was incredible. When you go back and you look at this, everything that you see behind me, the entire shoreline, was covered with oil. In fact, they came in with bales of straw. In those days, the, the technology to deal with oil spills was really in its infancy. They dumped hay up and down the coast for as far as you could see, trying to soak up the oil. Dave Davis was a college student at the time. All of us came down here, got involved in act actively cleaning up the seabirds. Our biggest devastation was what happened to our birds, particularly all the shorebirds who were covered in oil. Thousands of them died here. It was, it was very devastating, that part of it. It wasn't just the birds, it was all the sea life. You had, you know, the seals and the sea lions. Everybody was having a hard time making it through this disaster. Then came U.S. Senator Gaylord Nelson, who attended the one-year anniversary of the spill. Flying out of here, Senator Nelson looked down and said, what a precious earth we have here. We need to remember that we need to protect her. He came up with an idea to have an environmental teach-in and asked Dennis Hayes to help. I was a student at Harvard at the time, and uh, he persuaded me to drop out and come down to Washington to head up the teach-in. A few months later came Earth Day as we know it, an event celebrated across the world. It became very clear to me very early on that um, there was a lot more interest in this out in cities and communities, people who were fighting freeways, people who were worried about air pollution and their kids breathing it, um, than there was on college campuses. So my contribution to it was to give it a new name, Earth Day, instead of environmental teaching. Meanwhile, to Gerald Prohlman, each year is another chance to inspire others to change the planet, from sea to shining sea. I hope that people renew their commitment to the environment, and then they make choices in their life that contribute to a better world.